Welcome guys, welcome to Grammar English Level Elementary. Let's continue with me. Okay. And now we talk about numbers 10 until 20. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. In the 13 and also 19, just we added 10 in the ending of the word, okay? And 20 until 100, just we added TY. And also we have things in the classroom. We have a table, a chair, a computer, a CD player, a DVD player, a pen, a pencil, a book, a TV. We have a lot of things in the classroom, in the university, and also in the school. And also, we talk about days of the week. We have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Okay, it's all about numbers and also things in the classroom and also days of the week. And also, we have introducing yourself. In the, sec in the first time uh, you see someone, you say hello. Okay, in the second time, hi, and after that, nice to meet you. And also, and also, you say, nice to meet you too. And also, you can say, you too. Okay. And now, we talk about classroom instructions. Open your book, and also, look at the page 11. Look at the photo on page 11. Work in pairs, it means two by two. Work in groups. Listen and check, listen and practice. Ask and answer the questions. It's all about classroom instructions. Okay. Introducing yourself. In the first time, you say hello. In the Second time you say hi, and also after that you say nice to meet you, okay? And you can say you too. Classroom instructions, open your book. Look at the page 11, look at the page 12, look at the page 13, okay? Look at the photo on page 12, 11, 13, okay? Work in pairs, it means two by two. Work in groups, it means uh, two people and more. Listen and check. Listen and practice. As you can answer the questions. Okay. It's all about introducing yourself, classroom instructions. Okay about names what's your name my name is Shia and you can say it is Shia what's your first name it means the name of the father joy what's your surname it name is it uh, means name of the grandfather how do you spell that okay G A C K and you can say goodbye bye see you son see you See you on Friday, see you on Thursday, see you in Wednesday. Okay. Okay. It's about saying goodbye. Saying goodbye. Okay. This one is about. It's about a job. A manager, a doctor, a cleaner, a police officer, a teacher, a housewife, a builder, a student, an engineer, a lawyer, an actress, an actor, a sales assistant, a mechanic, an accountant, a musician. An actress for women, an actor for men, a waiter for men. And which is for women? Okay, it's about jobs. And now we talk about a and n articles. Okay, we use a with nouns that being with a consonant sound. The consonant are b, c, d, f, and extra. 
For example, a book, B is a consonant sound. A table, T. A mobile, M. A phone, P. A microphone, M. A student, S. A teacher, T. A laptop, L. Example, I am a teacher. I am a student. Okay? S consonant sound and also T consonant sound we use a because we have consonant sound in the start word we use and with nouns that being with a vowel sound okay the vowel sound a e i o u examples and also this one is examples a okay he is an actor a is a vowel sound okay he is an engineer, for example, or you say he is an English teacher. E is a vowel sound. He is an engineer. E is a vowel sound. We have two sounds in the language English, consonant sound and vowel sound. Okay. Don't forget a and an article. Okay all about it uh, and an um, articles it's very important for you especially for speaking and also that for writing it's very helpful for you don't forget it okay and focus on and be careful and now we talk about numbers 20 until 100 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 okay and 30 just we added ty in the ending of the word don't worry about that it's very important for you and also we have 40 50 60 70 80 90 100 or you can say a hundred okay it's all about numbers so we have personal positions a diary a wallet a mobile a watch a camera a suitcase a radio a coach a laptop a bag an umbrella shoes a bike a dresses sorry an id card for the teeth okay it's about personal positions and this one is about countries, nationalities, and languages. Okay, we have Brazil. Brazil. I'm from Brazil. I'm Brazilian. Chinese nationality, Brazilian. Okay, I speak Portuguese. Okay, and also we have Italy, Italian, okay, Italian, and also Italian, okay, and also Egypt. Okay, Egypt, Egyptian, Egyptian, Arabic. Okay, and also we have Spain, Spain, Spanish. Okay, Spanish, and also Spanish Okay oh, Sorry Turkey Turkey Turkish Turkish and also Turkish Okay Poland, Poland, Polish, Polish, and also 
polish okay china chinese chinese okay and also japan japan japanese Japanese okay and also France France okay France French and also that French okay and also we have Germany Germany okay German German and also German okay it's about countries nationalities and languages I'm from Brazil I'm from Italy I'm from Egypt I'm from Spain I'm from Turkey I'm from Poland I'm from China I'm from Japan I'm from France I'm from Germany nationality i'm brazilian i'm italian i'm egyptian i'm spanish i'm turkish i'm polish i'm chinese i'm japanese i'm french i'm german and language i speak portuguese i speak italian i speak arabic i speak spanish i speak turkish i speak polish i speak chinese i speak japanese i speak french i speak german it's all about countries not uh, countries okay nationalities and languages okay that's for you guys it's very helpful for you and uh fox on and also that it's very important for you and practice please practice practice to be better okay sorry about my spelling okay I'm really sorry talk about singular and plural singular is a one thing okay just one thing just one thing okay and plural two or more things okay okay plural. for example bag is a one thing change to plural bags just we added s book change to plural books okay okay a wallet wallet okay change to plural wallet but don't forget a because it's a one thing okay but when we change to plural just we added s and uh, it's not necessary to uh to use a okay because a to something is one thing not uh, two or more things but uh, when we use when we use s in the word is it means this you the this thing is, is a plural okay don't forget it and also we have we have for example watch okay we have watch when we have ch in the ending of the word just we added es just we added es okay watch for example finish we have sh okay es just we added es okay and also go we added es okay and also we have dresses s we added es okay and also okay 
and some word is we added I E S for example which one a diary okay a diary when we have Y in the ending of the word, it means change to I and also added ES. For example, diary. Diary. A diary. Diaries. Address. Okay. It's not necessary because it's not a noun. When we have a noun, we added A in the start the word because it's one thing not plural but when we have plural thing for example bag is book is wallet is watches finishes it doesn't need to add it a start in the word okay we have y when we have y when we have s and also that when we have o and also when we have sh and also when we have ch, ch, okay. We added es, okay. It's very important for you. It's about singular and plural. Singular one thing, plural two or more things. Uh, okay, uh, when uh, someone is, is a singular, we added a before the word okay but in the plural it doesn't need because the plural and just added s and es and also ies when we have y in the ending of the word when the s go o s h ch we added es don't forget it not we added ES toward this ending toward this ending all S S S and also Z and also Ch and also SH it's very important for you guys it's about singular and plurals and now you talk about the regular and irregular plural. We have a man. A man. Change to plural. Man. Okay. A woman. Change to woman. Okay. A child. Change to children. Okay. Okay, children. A person change to people. A tooth change to teeth. Okay. A man is a singular change to plural man. A woman is a singular change to plural woman. A child singular uh, change to plural children a person singular change to plural people a tooth singular change to plural teeth okay and now we talk about it asking for personal details asking for personal details okay okay well, for example What's your name? What is your first name? What is your surname? What is your nationality? What's your email addresses? Or you can say what is your address? Ok, 
Okay. What's your your phone number? Okay. What's your home number? Your home number. Okay. What's your postcode? Okay. What's your postcode? It's all about what asking for personal details. Okay, what's your name? What's your first name? What's your surname? What's your nationality? What's your email addresses? What's your addresses? What's your phone number? What's your home number? What's your postcode? It's all about asking for personal details. When you want to ask someone about which personal details okay and now we talk about it asking people to repeat things asking people to repeat things okay i'm sorry i'm sorry Could you say that again, please? Could you say that again, please? It's more polite. Could you say that again, please? Okay. Could you repeat that, please? Okay. Okay. Asking people to repeat things. Or you can say I am sorry. This is short form, but this is long form. Could you say that again, please? Could you repeat that? please okay now we talk about family family it means okay it means father and mother i love you okay we talk about male we talk about male and female and now we talk about male male father brother son boy grandfather okay uncle cousin husband okay it's all about male female girl sister sister wife okay wife grandmother and cousin and also that daughter here okay it's all about daughter it's about female it's about family male and female okay father brother son boy grandfather uncle cousin husband female girl sister wife grandmother and okay cousin daughters okay
and now we talk about time words sorry time words okay let's talk about uh, and now we talk about time words 60 seconds it means one minute okay and 60 minutes which means one hour okay one hour and also 24 hour which means one day one day okay seven day seven days minus one week okay 12 months which minus one year it's about time for this 60 second one minute 16 minutes one hour 24 hour one day seven days one week 12 months one year it's all about time this okay and now we talk about where thing is in a house okay you have a mirror okay a mirror a door a window A plant, a disc, a table, a lamp, a curtains. Sorry, curtains. Okay, and also. A bookcase okay a sofa a carpet okay and the floor fingers in a house we have a lot of fingers in your house, my house, they house, okay. A mirror, a door, a window, a plant, a disc, a table, a lamp, a curtains, a bookcase, a sofa, a carpet, the floor. And also, for example, we have um, uh, no glasses, okay, glasses, and also um a mobile and also a tv okay now we talk about talking about what is the time okay talking about the time okay for example what time is it is it what time is it okay i say it is one o'clock okay it's one o'clock And what is the time, please? What is the time, please? What is the time, please? It's about half past seven. Or you can say it's about what? Two o'clock. Okay. 
Excuse me, have you got the chime, please? Me. Have you got the chime, please? In the sentences, we use have got. Okay, we use have got. Yes, it's for 15. Okay, yes, it is for 15. It's about talking. Okay, it's about talking. About what is the time? What time is it? It's one o'clock. What is the time, please? It's about two o'clock. It's about seven past eleven, for example. Excuse me, have you got the time, please? Yes, it's four fifteen. It's easy to say that. Not past two. It's. It's not important to say that. Okay. Don't worry about that. 4.15. 9.20. 9.30. Okay. It's very easy to say it. Uh, but uh, it's not important to say that. 1 past 13. Okay. It's not important. Customer. Can. Can I have. Two tickets. Can I have two tickets for the, for example, sisters? Please. Okay. Ticket seller. Say yes. Of course. Customer, customer, how much? Sorry, how much is that? How much is that? Okay, ticket seller. That is, for example, ten dollar. For example, please. Okay. Okay. Customer, customer, here you, here you are. What time is the film? Okay, what time is the film? Ticket sell is seller. Start is start is at seven fifteen. Okay. It start is it start is in two minutes. Okay. Customer. Summer. Right. Thank is a lot. Okay, thanks a lot. And thank you so much. Ticket seller, you are welcome. 
you are welcome. Enjoy the film. That's all about the buying tickets at the cinema. Buying tickets at the cinema when you want to go to the cinema with your friends, with your family, and also with your sister, and also with your relative, you must buying tickets. And this person buying tickets to the cinema, okay, it means customer, okay. Can I have two tickets for the sisters, please? ticket seller okay yes of course customer how much is that ticket seller that is ten dollar please okay customer here you are what time what time is the film okay Ticket seller, it starts at 7.15, it starts in 2 minutes, okay? Customer, hi, thanks a lot, and thank you so much, ticket seller. You are welcome, enjoy the film, and also enjoy your time. Enjoy your time. It's all about buying tickets at the cinema, okay? Okay. And now we talk about it months. Okay. January. January. February. February. March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December, okay, December, okay, March, April, May, June, July, December, January twenties, month one, two, three, four, five. Six. Six. Okay. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Okay, it's all about months. Okay, we use in with months. Okay, we use we use in with months. Is, for example, my birthday is
my birthday is in December. Okay, we used in with months. My birthday is in December. Okay. Now we talk about daily routines. Okay. Routines. Okay. Get up. Okay. I get up at seven o'clock. Get up. Go to bed. Okay. I go to bed. I go to bed at uh, nine uh, p.m. Okay. Have breakfast. Okay. Have breakfast. I have. Break first, okay, in the morning. Okay. Okay. Have dinner. I have dinner in the evening. Star work. I start work at seven o'clock in the morning okay start work finish work i finish work in the evening at seven for example o'clock Look. Okay, finish work. Finish classes. I finish my classes at, uh, for example, six o'clock every day. Okay. Leave home. I leave home at six o'clock, for example, and then I go to work. Okay. Get home. I get home at the evening. Work. I go to work Okay Study I study English every day at the home Okay Sleep I Go to bed at, for example, seven o'clock. Okay, and then I am sleep. Okay. Live. I live in in a house. Daily routine is 
Get up, I get up at 7 o'clock. Go to bed, I go to bed at 9 o'clock. Okay. Okay. Have breakfast, I have breakfast in the morning. Or you can say, I have breakfast at 7 o'clock in the morning. Okay. At 7 o'clock in the morning. Okay. Have dinner, I have dinner at 7 o'clock. Sorry. Okay. At 7 o'clock in the evening. Start work, I start work at 7 o'clock. Okay. In the morning, finish work. I finish work in the evening at seven o'clock. Okay, finish classes. I finish my class at six o'clock every day. Leave home. I leave home at six o'clock. Okay. And then I go to bed. Okay. Get home. I get home at the evening. Work. I go to work. Study, I study English every day at the home. Sleep, I go to bed at 7 o'clock and then I am sleep. Live, I live in a house. Okay. It's all about daily routines. Okay. And you can write down about your daily routine. It's very helpful, uh, especially for reading and writing. And also that's very important for you and to improve your speaking. Okay. Now, so it's all about present simple, okay? It's about daily routine. And now we talk about phrases for special days. For special days. Okay, let's talk about it. A birthday. A birthday okay you say happy birthday when your friend is a birthday day you say happy birthday okay a wedding okay a wedding and the bears, the bears, a new baby. Okay, new baby. You say congratulations. Congratulations. Okay. And also, a new year is if party. You say Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Okay. Okay. And also, a wedding anniversary. Anniversary. Happy anniversary. You say happy. You say happy anniversary. Okay. For instance, for special days, a birthday. Happy birthday, a wedding and the birth, a new baby, congratulations. A new year's eve party, happy new year. A wedding anniversary, happy anniversary. When your friend is 
birthday day you say happy birthday a wedding and the birth a new baby you say congratulations okay a new year's if you party you say happy new year a wedding anniversary you say happy anniversary it's all about phrases for special days okay with your family and also with your friends okay and now we talk about talking about these and dates talking about these and dates sorry about days and dates what day is it today okay what day is it today or you can say what is the date today okay and also what is the date tomorrow okay and also when is your birthday when is your birthday okay talking about days and dates what day is it today what is the date today what is the day tomorrow when is your birthday or you can say is okay what day is it today it's it's friday what is the date today? It is. It is the fifth, fifth of March. Of March. Okay. What is the date tomorrow? Okay. It is. March the sixth. Okay. When is your birthday? Can okay, you say it is on? It's on June. Okay, June the third. So about talking about these and dates. What day is it today? It's Friday. When is your birthday? It's on June and the 3rd. It's all about talking about days and dates. What day is it today? It's Friday. What is the date today? It's the 5th of March. Okay. What is the date tomorrow? It is March the 6th when is your birthday it's on june the third you can say it's on december the 24th okay it's all about we're talking about these and dates let's continue let's talk about suggestions you want to buy something to someone special and you ask a question uh, to your friend is what shall we get her for example or you can say what shall we buy it okay and she said to you what about an mp3 player and I I say no I don't think so okay why don't we get her a book okay maybe okay let's get her a dvd yes that's a good idea okay we can say get or buy what shall we get or you can say what shall we buy her we use with infinitive after what shall we and let us what shall we do tonight and let's go to the cinema okay it's all about it it's all about suggestions okay hmm. 
what shall we get here and my friend say what about an mp3 player and i say no i don't think so and my friends okay why don't we get her a book and me maybe and my friend let's get her a dvd and me yes that's a good idea it's all about suggestions okay let's talk about free time activity okay in my free time okay i go to the bazaar with my family and some time is and some time is i watch tv and listen to podcast and also that i have a lot of work when i have when i have free time uh, i help mom i help mom to clean the house and i read a book and uh, sometime I read a book uh, or you can say I read a short story short story and listen to the radio and watch sport on TV okay. and when we go to the go to the for example art gallery uh, we take a photo with my friends okay okay and also that when we when i have free time i i play game okay i play game or you can say i play v video game okay it's my free time in my free time i go to the bazaar with my family and sometimes i watch tv and listen to podcasts and also that i have a lot of work okay when i have free time i help mom okay to clean sorry to clean the house and i sometimes and sorry And sometimes I read a short story and listen to the radio and watch sports on TV. And when we go to the art gallery, we took we took a photo with my friends. And also that when I have the time, I play video game. And also after that, I go to bed. It's uh, all about my free time. When I have free time, I do this activity okay now so i uh, we talk about it think is you like and you don't like okay you don't like for example 
I like cats, but I don't like duck. Okay. I like play tennis, but I don't like play football. Okay. I like take a photo, but I don't like. Uh, but I don't like. Okay. Shopping for clothes. Okay, clothes. I like running, but I don't like. Uh, about things you like and you don't like okay and also uh, you can write down about your hobby and also about your uh, something you like and also something you don't like I adore a tremendous I love so so much. Okay. It means hundred percent. Hundred percent I love. Okay. I love it's normal. I really like it's fifty uh, percent. Okay. I like it means forty uh, percent. I could like it minus um, it minus thirty uh, percent. Okay, is R okay? It's okay. Twenty percent. It depends. I don't like. It's I don't like. Okay. I hate. It minus I hate this one. I love. I don't want. Okay, I don't want. It's all about. This one. And now we talk about it. Yes. 18, 30, 30s, 5. 80, 35. Nineteen hundred. Nineteen, okay, nineteen, ninety. Nineteen, ninety, okay. Twenty, twenty, eighty. And now we talk about years 18, 35. 18, 100, 19, 90, 20, 18. It's not different about. And also it's not uh, difficult to learn it, okay? Just for you guys it's very very helpful for you okay you can say 2018 19 19 
Seventeen. Okay. Okay. Seventeen. Seventeen. Sixty. Okay. Sixty eight. Nineteen eighty two. Okay, nineteen eighty two. Nineteen nineteen twenty. Twenty-eight. It's all about years. Okay, it's very important and it's very easy to you and to your guys. It's very easy to your guys. Okay, don't worry about that. And also we have okay, uh, sixty, sixteen, twenty-seven. So about what year is it's very important for you guys okay 1835 1900 19 20 18 20 17 17 68 okay 90 19 82 1928 60 27 it's all about here it's very easy just uh, you want to practice more than more to improve your uh, years okay years and also uh, learn english and also we have 15 32 okay which minus 15 uh, thirty two. It's all about years. It's very easy. Just you wanna practice more than more. Okay, okay. Now we talk about live events. Live events. Okay, let's talk about live events. For example, live, live. School, university. Okay, leave school, university, leave, and also home. Okay. Meet my friends. Meet my parents. Okay, and also meet uh, my, for example, wife meet my husband husband okay when you don't live with your family you say meet my parents you meet your parents your family your sister your brother okay and also that meet get married get married okay get divorce
make 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 a film a film okay make a lot of money became sorry become okay become a famous and also became a film director okay director have children have a dream okay have move house move house move to a different country okay study study english study spanish study arabic okay write a book write a letter okay win an oscar win the lottery it's all about life event is leave home school university meet my friends my parents sorry my parents my wife my husband get married get divorced okay make a film make a lot of money became a famous became a film director have children have a dream okay move houses move to a different country study english spanish arabic chinese okay write a book write a letter win an oscar win the lottery it's all about life events okay now we talk about it, weakness activities okay weekend activities okay let's talk about weekend activities go for which means go for a walk okay walk okay go for a walk go for a run okay go for a run okay okay we need activities go for a walk go for okay go for a run clean the car clean the house do the washing do your homework write a book write a letter write a report okay go away for the weekend okay go away for a couple of days have a great time have a bad cold okay go away for a weekend 
go away for the weekend go away for a couple of days have a great time have a bad cold go to a party okay go to your parents house house for lunch stay with friends stay at home all weekend it's all about weekend activities okay go away for the weekend go away for a couple of days have a great time have a bad school go to a party go to your parents house for lunch stay with friends stay at home all weekend it's all about weekend activities okay and now we talk about adjectives with very really quite true okay very really quite true comes after the verb to be and before adjectives which mean example i was really exhausted really the adjective okay comes after the verb to be the restaurant was quite dirty okay was quite dirty quite is the adjective is we don't use to main very very okay focus on it's very important we don't use to main very very for example she is really happy okay she is really happy we cannot say she is too happy it's wrong it's wrong it's the sentence is wrong okay be careful comes after the verb to be and before adjective is but we don't use to main very very okay okay it's very helpful for you it's just not for you guys it's very helpful for you to it doesn't mean very very i'm happy for you oh nice oh great i'm sorry for you oh dear what a shame I'm surprised. Wow. Really? You are joking. I'm not surprised. Oh, right. It's all about what? Showing interest. Okay, when someone say you, I'm happy for you. You say, oh, nice. Oh, great. And someone uh, say you, I'm sorry for you. Oh, dear. What a shame. And someone say you, I'm surprised wow you say really you are joking and someone say you i'm not surprised oh right it's all about showing interest okay when someone say to you okay now we talk about asking follow-up questions question is you can ask someone who was ill at the weekend what was wrong are you okay now stayed at home what did you do went to the cinema what did you see what was it like who did you go with went away for the weekend what was it like where did you go who did you go with where did you stay it's all about it so about asking follow up question is okay when someone asks you in your weakness when you stay at home when you want to the cinema when when you want away for the weakness so about asking follow up question is okay now we talk about it, the internet use the internet use use with the internet use the internet send send emails sorry send emails okay get emails get emails okay read 
a blog. This kind of the website blog. Okay. Download. Download videos. Or music, or something like go download, go online, go online. Okay, have a favorite website. Okay, have chat, sorry, chat to your friends, chat to your friends, okay, have Wi-Fi. Have Wi Fi. Use a search. Use a search engine. It's all about the internet. Use the internet. Use the internet. Send emails. Get emails. Read a blog. Download videos or music. Go online. Have a favorite website. Chat to to your friends. Okay, chat to your friends. Have Wi-Fi. Use a search engine. It's all about the internet. Okay. Use send get read download go have chat have and also that use it's all about vocabulary to use the internet okay to use the internet not for you guys it's very helpful for you we can say get emailers or receive emailers okay we can say get emailers or receive emailers it's not difference between that we download music or video onto a computer. Okay, we use onto a computer, laptop, or computer or laptop. We download music or video onto a computer, or you can say onto a laptop. The opposite of download is upload. Okay, we can say that chat to someone or chat with someone okay you can say chat to someone or chat with someone chat to someone chat with someone we can say chat to someone or chat with someone Google is a popular engine. We can also use Google as a verb. As a verb. Okay. Why don't you Google it? Okay. Email. Okay. Email. Download video, chat, and blog can be nouns or verbs. Okay. Can be nouns or verbs. I email my brother a lot. She blogs every day. Download video chat and blog can be nouns or verbs. I email my brother a lot. She blogs every day. 
it's all about it, the internet and notice for you guys it's very helpful for you and don't forget it and focus on